Good afternoon, Yorktown, and welcome to The Core, the afternoon web show produced by 6th graders at Mildred E. Strang Middle School. Today is June 2nd, 2015. Let's start the show by getting an update on the afternoon weather conditions with our student meteorologist. Hello, Yorktown. I'm student meteorologist Rebecca. The time is now 12.30 and the temperature outside is 52 degrees. As you would see from the parking lot behind me, we're experiencing rain showers and cloudy skies. The precipitation is 62% and the humidity is 85%. The wind speed is 7 miles per hour and it's a good day to stay inside and read a good book. Have yourself a wonderful day and let's take it back to you in the studio. Thanks for that update, Rebecca. Now let's try to put a smile on your face with the jokes of the day. Hi, my name is Olivia, and here are some jokes intended to put a smile on your face. What time does a duck wake up? At the quack of dawn. Why did the tree go to the dentist to get a root canal? Back to you in the studio. Nice job, Olivia. Let's go get inside the head of a sixth grade student with a day in the life. My name is Zanga. Welcome to my life. What's on my mind right now is how I'm going to do on my social studies test. Something that made me happy in the last 24 hours was swimming in the pool. Something that made me sad in the last 24 hours was getting into a fight with my friend. Something that I regret in the last 24 hours was not doing my homework earlier. Something that I'm looking forward to in the next 24 hours is playing outside at recess. I need to get back to my life now. Let's take it back to you in the studios. Thanks for letting us get to know a little bit more about you. Now let's go to our 6 and 60 sports report. I want to talk about who will win the NBA Finals. I think the K Cleveland Cavaliers will win the NBA Finals because they have a lot of good players on their team. I want to talk about how the NFL is expanding to other countries. I feel it is not a good idea because it's going to cost a lot of money for the NFL. I want to talk about who will win the NBA Finals. I think Golden State will win because they have Stephon Curry. I would like to talk about the NBA Finals. I think the Cleveland Cavaliers are going to win because they have Timothy Mozgov. I want to talk about the NBA Finals and I want the Golden State Warriors to win because they have Stephen Curry. I want to talk about who's going to win the NBA Finals. I think Golden State's going to win because I think that their new team is really good and that they're going to win by a long shot. That was today's 6 and 60. Now let's take it back to you in the studios. Thanks, Alyssa. Now let's improve our vocabulary with the word of the day. Hi, my name is Alyssa, and welcome to the segment dedicated to improving your vocabulary, the word of the day. Today's word is sage. Sage is a noun and an adjective. Sage is defined as wise or a very wise person. Intelligent and knowledgeable are synonyms for sage. In a sentence, sage can be used like this. My sister always gives me sage advice. Sage, can you use it today? Starlight, star bright, the first thing I see tonight. I wish I may, I wish I might, have the wish I wish tonight. We were curious. If you could have any wish granted, what would it be? Let's see what the kids in the hall have to say. If I could have one wish granted, it would be to have a mansion. If I could have one wish granted, I would become a professional baseball player. If I could have one wish granted, I would be 16 so I could drive all of my favorite cars. If I could have one wish granted, it would be to have a hundred other wishes. If I could have one wish, I'd wish to have a lot of wisdom. If I could have one wish granted, it would be to always be happy. If I can have one wish, it would for everything to be free in life so you don't have to pay for anything. Everyone would be equal in society, so there would be no poor people and no really rich people. If I could have one wish, it would be to shoot threes like Steph Curry. Thanks, kids. Now let's go to today in history. Hi, my name is Kyle, and I'm going to share some fun facts and events that took place on this day in history. On this day in 1941, baseball great Lou Gehrig died of ALS. Sticking with this theme, we're going to focus today's fun facts on Lou Gehrig. Did you know that Lou Gehrig hit 23 career grand slams? Did you know that he was voted into the Hall of Fame the same year that he retired? Thanks for watching today. Did you know? Hopefully, now you know. Thanks, Kyle. Now let's go to the lesson of the day. Today's lesson is from math. Today in math class, we learned about median, mean, and mode. To find the median, you must put all the numbers in order. To find the mode, you need to find the most often number. That's our show for Monday, June 2nd, 2015. Thanks to all the students who contributed. Have a great afternoon and join us again if you can tomorrow. Until then, remember to be safe, responsible, and respectful.